part is not in filming this one. Oh well, it's fast. It's, it's very, fast. very fast. We do not get to see bat. We not do not get to see Batgirl ass as much as I would like. Oh, and she does not have nipples on her suit. However, I am okay with it because a they were talking about that. Uh, they asked him about that. and He goes, "Well, if we put nipples on the suit, it just looks like a naked woman." Standards and practice was not going to allow this. Fair. And but also to be fair, yeah, okay, we don't actually have protruding nipples. They don't have a problem showing them poking though. And not to mention the bat just frames boob. Yeah. So I'm like, well. you know what? All right, I, I I can't complain because it's not like they're hiding her boobs. So I'm all right with it. It's fine. It's equal opportunity for everyone as far as how pornographic this is. I'm okay with it. Uh, Robin goes to Ivy. Mm-hmm. This is where it's like, give me a sign. You want a sign? Slippery when wet. Yeah, that's just, that's just vagina. And then they kiss and she's like, oh, you're an idiot. You're dead now. And he's like, nope, rubber lips. Fuck you. Well, because, yeah, it starts out with like, you know, tell me your plan. Kiss me. Kiss me and I'll tell you. Tell me and you'll, I'll kiss you. Fucking hell. What are we in grade school? Fuck off. And then, you know. And then she kicks him out of yeah, bed. <laughs> I guess. Can I ask what ends up happening here? So she's sitting on this plant mm-hmm. in its mouth. Mm-hmm. This ma- this plant that eats eats people, right? Mm-hmm. She's sitting on it. And it's obeying everything she says. Let's continue with the rest of the movie. I know. Anyways, she walks, she's going to walk out. Mm-hmm. Batman shows up. She strings him up. Yep. And then Batgirl, Batgirl gets a bad down. entrance. Yep. So that's cool. But she's not wearing a cowl, so if she jumps through a piece of glass like that, her face is getting cut up to shit. But whatever, yeah, that's cool. So they fight, and she gives her a lesson on feminism, I suppose. I guess. Like, don't, you're using you your give, feminine wiles yeah, to... It's uh, the oldest trick in the yeah. book. You give chicks like us a bad name. I'm like, oh, well, you use chicks, but that's cool. Whatever. That's what I said. I'm like, you use the word chicks, yeah, but whatever. you failed it, but whatever. That's cool. So then she kicks her into said plant that was obeying her a minute ago. And it's now eating her. What? I don't know. Okay. Either way, mm-hmm. I Batgirl, that's a little not PC. Not PC, right? Well, Why not Batperson or Batwoman? I'm like, well, there already is one of those. Yeah. So let's not do that. It's your cousin. Yeah. She's got a new show on CW. <laughs> yeah, and no one's going to watch it, apparently. Um, so, yeah, so that happens. And this is where it gets even dumber. Because they go, because Freeze is frozen Gotham. Yeah. And like, all right. We gotta stop them. So what do they do? <laughs> they go home. Yep. And put on new outfits and get new fucking vehicles. Yep. Why? I mean, toy commercial. Toy commercial. But within the context of the movie, she just put on this outfit. Now she got a new one. She got a new one. Fuck you. All right, just fuck you. So the Bat Family get a plan. Yep. You guys take over there. I'll take over here. Okay, you break. Mm-hmm. Well, uh, we have Batgirl they finally the in. They have which, Batgirl finally in the fucking uh, the cowl for thirty seconds. Yeah, which um, they thought the scientist, but this mm-hmm. whole movie, yeah, this whole fucking movie, mm-hmm. on more than one occasion, yep. it's established mm-hmm. once something mm-hmm. or someone yep. gets frozen, mm-hmm. you have eleven minutes. And so you're telling me from the time that Mr. Bane and Mr. Freeze mm-hmm. attacked and froze these scientists yeah. to that whole thing with Ivy, yep. to them going home and changing, mm-hmm. to them attacking mm-hmm. Mr. Freeze properly, Yep. this was less than 11 minutes? Yeah. Absolutely. Makes perfect sense. Okay. Sure. Moving on. Yeah. So... Because, again, we got to sell more toys. we got to wear new outfits. So... Batman takes on Mr. Freeze. Mm-hmm. Bane takes on the kids. Yes. That's not even a fight. It's literally, he holds them up for two seconds. Mm-hmm. They kick... They it, kick the... His tube! His yeah. tube! They kick the they tube kick out. They kick the tube out and basically kill him. Yeah. Or reduce him they back reduce to him being... They reduce him back to being the little skinny, skinny guy. Skinny Miller. That doesn't work, but that's cool. Um, He later gets killed, I think, by the collapsing everything. Yeah, probably. They don't care. Uh, Batman's plan mm. to thaw out the city... Mm-hmm. Is to use a network of satellites mm-hmm. to take sunlight from the Congo. Because they know it's morning in the Congo right now. Which Because everyone knows that. How do you know that? Common knowledge. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> According to my fucking bat watch, it's morning yeah. at 6 a.m. in the Congo. Yeah. So he's gonna take. He's going to take sunlight from the Congo. He's going like, to... is it going to be pitch black in the Congo now? Are you taking the sun away? What are you? He's doing? going to somehow make a satellite fly over to the Congo. Reflect it from the Congo into the... 
yes, they are taking sunlight from the Congo because this is reflecting the sunlight to something else. To another satellite, to another satellite, to another satellite. That's going to <laughs> that's going to blow Gotham. some minds in Congo. Yeah, when they look outside, like, it is seven in the morning and there's the no sun. sun. Go, um, <laughs> we're having an eclipse right now. They're going I don't to know think why. the Lord is angry at them. Yes, and they probably is. Um, so before that plan but fuck works, you, Congo Batman needs sun. Before that plan works, yeah. Uh, as as he thought he's defeated, Mister Freeze. Yeah. Uh, no, no, no. One last thing for you. Can I bombs away, Batman? And yeah, he blows up the thing, and the thing Can collapses. Can I point out that the two scientists are hanging yep. on the thing? Yep. And Batman does not save them. No. He tells Until them the to very hang on. end. He tells them to yep. hang on. Yep. No. That is not. Batman saves these people, then does whatever he's going to do. This is stupid. Anyway. So as he's falling, they all would die. But they, because apparently these scientists can now hold on with the strength of Batman. Because they hold on whilst all this is going on. I'm not quite sure how, but they do. So he gets out of there, he saves them, kind of, <laughs> kind by of. just leaving them there <laughs> yeah. at the bottom of wherever okay. the hell this Re- is. Remember when I said that they didn't, that he didn't kill anyone? I'm wrong. They died. How were they getting out of there? I don't know. Where they dead. were. I don't even know where they even were. were they, they were had, dead. I don't know. They were on an edge of... Something. The end Literally of going, Gotham Island. Literally going, Batman! Yeah. I'm like... Why? So you can die of starvation now? Because you're not leaving that place. So he hops up. Yep. The kids hatch a ride. Mm Mm-hmm. They get there. They take out Freeze once and for all. Yeah. He's mad because... Ivy says later, uh, or later on, early. He in the said film, earlier, yeah. like she's just she like killed, I he, killed him because there can be only one woman in this but outfit. But she told Freeze that Batman killed her. I mean, no one was filming that, but yeah. it, apparently it was filmed. And he's just like, "You killed my wife." He's like, "No, no I, didn't. I didn't. In fact, I saved her. Yeah, uh, we found her, revived her, and here's the footage proving that, that, that Ivy did it. Here's here's Batman and Robin. Yeah. <laughs> like, here's the movie. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna show you some of the movie because frankly, nobody else is gonna watch this shit." So, and then he's like, oh, well, fair enough. Oh, cool. And he's like, well, hey, uh, since, freeze. Since I did you a favor. Help me. Doctor, please. You've cured the, uh, the beginning of McGregor Syndrome. Please tell me how. And he fucking has yeah. to make one last goddamn pun. Yeah, no problem. Here you go. And he's, he pops it out and just goes, take two of these and call me in the morning. Oh, fuck you. All right, just just fuck you. Takes him, puts him in the thing. Mm-hmm. Fucking let, now we do is wait. And literally Alfred wakes up like he just needed a nap. Yeah, He's well, like, I do find it I do find it weird. And I noticed this and I don't know why I noticed it, but I kinda did. I'm like, so Batman just took off the cowl to do all this. Robin just took off the domino mask. Batgirl changed her whole outfit. Yep. I don't want to say I, anything, you know. I, I don't, don't wanna I, I, I don't know why it was so important. Whatever, but you know it's what? just so weird. Here's the just weird so thing. Weird. Here's another weird thing about this movie. Mm. It's the only. It's the only out of the four goddamn movies where mm. you actually see eye black on their face. That's true. That is true. They do have eye black. It's not thick. It should be thick, but it's but still it's there. there. But it's fucking so there. It's just like it's so weird that you have those attention to detail. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. It is so strange. This so Al wakes no up. Sense. No problem. Hey, whatever, like, whatever disease he had is, is now cured, gone. and he's just like, "I thought I taught you people to take better care of yourself." Ow. This, this place is a sty. <laughs> when did you? When did you have time to teach them to take care of themselves better, asshole? You've been cleaning up after them forever. They're... Batman forever, <laughs> exactly. And fucking and and apparently Barbara hasn't learned either, even though she's never had a butler. And now it just like and we team, get the team, we get the stupid thing of like team? He, he's just yeah. like you're going back to school, yeah. Bruce. You're never winning this argument. And I'm like, oh, why don't you all just fuck? Like and seriously. Then, and dun, then dun, it's dun, just dun, like, are we going to be friends? Dun, yeah. Dun, dun. Then they do the run. Yeah. And then we're done. And and then we get the best thing about this movie: the end is the beginning is the end playing. Yeah. Credits. Mm-hmm. That's it. Mm-hmm. We're done here. Oh boy. Um. Yeah. This truly is one of the only movies... Well, this is, I think, out of the 47 episodes that we've done, mm-hmm. this might be the only movie that I can confidently say I will probably never watch again. Um, I can't say that. Well, no, you can't. Because I know you, I will watch this again. 
Really? Um, oh, I know I will. I've seen the fact that I've seen this as many times as I have isn't surprising to me. And the fact is, I know I will see this again. Like, I fucking know I will. Like, like you think you'll be just you'll run a Batman marathon yeah. again? You know, if I gotta watch all yes, four, I will do it. I've done it before. I'm gonna do it again. There's a reason I bought that fucking box set of all four of these movies, even though just based on the, the reviews I've given here, I'm only really a big fan of one of them. But I bought the whole set for a hundred fucking damn dollars. And I've watched them all. I thankfully waited long enough to get a set where I get these four plus all the Supermen. Mm. Which, again, out of that, you only get like one or two good ones. So Yeah, that's true. Although, for the price I paid, there's enough good in there to justify for Blu-ray purchases. Sure. Either way, mm. this movie mm-hmm. gets... And this number mm. also reflects my feeling of this movie and what I think <laughs> of it. Yeah. <laughs> two! Because <laughs> it is a number two. Yeah. Hockey team from hell's out of 10. Uh, Easily the lowest score I've given on this show, and probably the lowest score I'm going to give for quite some time. Hmm. Now, I know that's a bold statement because I don't know what the future holds, but I yeah. mean... Um, I, I will give this film actually a 3. Um, just pick a fucking ice pun out of 10. <laughs> Because I don't, I don't dislike it as much as you did. Well, um, three out of ten isn't exactly no. I, I didn't. I don't glowing. like it. Believe me. But there, the only reason I gave it a little higher is because I have done this, and I do recommend that if you're ever going to watch this, this is how you do it: is you get some friends together oh, and yeah, you yeah, imbibe yeah, yeah, something, yeah, 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 and it yeah, becomes it's... infinitely watchable. It becomes so bad it's good. That would be the only way I watch yeah. this movie again. And that's what I think it is. It's like that's why I can't give it such a low rating because well, I'm like three out of ten the is way... the lowest rating you've given. Yeah, which is unfortunate because I would like to retroactively change a couple of them. But yeah. I think this has a little bit of a higher rating just because watching it the way I did, this is why I have to give it a low. Watching it the way I did, which is by myself, just watching it, just to sit and watch a movie, is not fun. But you get friends together and it becomes infinitely more fun. So I can't give it a like a dismal score I can give it a 3 which is not a great score but at least I can call it something and far as MVPs go I give it to Bane because I think it's hilarious that every scene he's in he's like says a word like it's like exit <laughs> Bane exit uh, <laughs> plus him the image of Bane alone as a chauffeur <laughs> can I can I give it to the end credits um, <laughs> no I'm giving it to John Glover um, yeah two, that too the two scenes yeah. he's in are amazing um, I would like to give it to Michael Goff, but I can't because he's only good in one scene. Uh, the rest of it is just the shit that, you know, Akiva and Gordon gave him to say. And Schwarzenegger's Thurman annoying. Or... Uma Thurman's annoying. Bane, as fun as he is, I still like John Glover a, a wee bit better. Because um, honestly, watching the John Glover, like, because his scenes are in the very beginning. I'm looking yeah. at this going, I, you know what? I might not hate this movie as much. And then he dies. And, and then, then he dies, and I'm like, oh, shit, we're back You've to this You've just killed shit. the best thing in yeah. this movie. Yeah, I'm like, and now we got to sit and listen to fucking Bruce and Dick fight the whole time. And I'm like, "There's, it's called Batman and Robin. Can't you get along once? Oh, fuck this movie. All right, we're done. So, moving away from that, an, un- an unfortunate end to the Ugh. Batman months. <laughs> yeah. We do need a bit of a pa- palate cleanser before Halloween. Yes. Um... And soon our 50th episode. Yeah. That's crazy. Hey, there you go. So as for a palate cleanser, we wanted something we thought was going to be light and fluffy as in light notes. Nope. Turns out no. Turns out they actually... Because, they I'll actually... be honest with you, it's Steve. He digs. <laughs> I didn't dig hard, dude. No. No. I literally typed in... <laughs> you kind of poked the ground I, and... Yeah, and I literally typed in... Struck, yeah, I typed gold. in the making of this movie and shit happened. I'm like, there's actually stuff about this. No, I mean, it's not going to be on the level of Batman, but there's a surprising amount of shit there. So it is going to be a little bit themed. A little uh, bit. And a bit of a double feature. Yeah. Um, a double feature, actually, which uh, suggests most people watch mm-hmm. watch these movies back to back. I mean, they kind of go together really well. We will be going, we'll be starting next week mm-hmm. by going way back to August 18th, 1995 mm-hmm. for the video game Movie classic, <laughs> Mortal Kombat! So you and, can kind of guess what the other one's going to be, but we'll yeah. save that for next and week. And yes, I have made the intro, and yes, that song features rather prominently. Well, because that's like... The greatest song ever written. <laughs> can we give MVP to that song? <laughs> I might. I might. So it'll be a pal at Kenzer because, you know, it's it's as as maybe the notes might be deeper than yeah. we think the movie isn't. It's a no, dumb it's a dumb it's, it's a dumb, dumb but fun. It's a dumb fun video game yeah. movie about a dumb fun video game fighting uh-huh. exactly. uh, f- a dumb video uh, fighting video game. 
Easy so, for you to say. Easy for me to say. Um, so we're going to do that next week. Again, mm-hmm. you can kind of piece together what the other one's going to be at the end of September. Yeah. But for this week and all this Batman buffoonery. <laughs> Finally, we're done with this shit. <laughs> the Batman months have concluded. <laughs> we're going to get out of here. Mm-hmm. You were Steve.